Howdy y'all, I'm TJ with Bear Gaming. Welcome back to 7 Days to Die, Darkness Falls the Farmer. Alright, morning of day 27. We got Blood Moon tomorrow, so we gotta get cooking. Oh look. First Zombo of the day. And he gave us a present, how kind. So I've got about 100 log spikes. And we will use those just all over the floor of the base. Where's my machete? I also have a good amount of concrete. We should be able to upgrade everything to concrete. Um, yeah, we had a little issue last night with a wandering horde, and normally they, they run sideways. This time, they literally came right at the base, so we lost our chicken goop. Unfortunate. I also have an SMG turret because I invested a point intellectual traps. So we can also use that since we're not really using our 9mm like at all. So we were going to put that in a cool location. I also have a generator, a bunch of gas, an engine, and all the necessities. So we are going to grab everything. We're going to head over to Blood Moon Base. I'm going to start laying down everything. I'll see you there. Alright, we've arrived at Blood Moon Base. All we have to do now is upgrade all of the wood plates to wood, and then cobblestone, and then concrete. Then we will head to the roof and start breaking those out. We also have to break out the platforms. Uh, probably should upgrade over here. Do some repairing. Oh, I didn't bring the iron. That's okay. Let's get to it. I hear a screamer. Here she comes. I guess we made too much ruckus. I. Oh. Hang. He actually called in a horde. Yeah, they must not enlighten me uh, collapsing that little thing over there. That's okay. Ooh, I heard you. Alright, let's see if we can melee him. We can. I didn't see the little debuff he kind of put on me. I don't know what that was. Oh. Hi. Here, another one over here. Oh, he got me. More coppers. Missed. Thank you. I hear more. Are you it? Sounds like it. Yeah, like as soon as I drop that platform. 
which took forever. Yeah, so now we just got to clean up all the scrap that we left on the ground and then probably uh, do what we did here. So I replaced those iron ladders with these concrete ones because they have 5k and these only have 500. So we'll do that. We'll make the second way up and then I want to plug this hole here. I don't think I'll plug this one here. But what I will do is I think we're going to do a ramp probably from like this corner here up that way. Break that out and make a ramp here. That way they have three ways up. So they can go this way, they can go that way, or they can go this way. If they break stuff out, we'll be in trouble. So we've got our SMG turret pointed this way. Um, I still have to put the generator and stuff down. I'll find a place for it and then run the switches. And then I do have a bunch of lights I'm also going to install so we can see. Check the time real quick. Yeah, we're past noon. Probably 13, 1400 hours. And then I do want to run another scout quest. I need to get used to taking out the demons. So we'll do that as soon as we're done cleaning up, converting the ladders over to concrete, building the ramp. Uh, we can always save the electrical stuff for tomorrow. I am building a bunch of electric fences as well. So we can just do the electric work tomorrow morning and just run out the rest of the day with quests. Another one? Yeah, for sure, another one. I don't think she got a scream off. I don't hear nothing. Let us continue. Okay, I think we are good to go now. We've got all the platforms ripped out. Got the ladders upgraded to concrete on both sides. And I have this ramp. So I'm probably going to put the electric fences maybe here. If I can slow them down a little bit here, that may be good. Or I'll put them on. Um, the last leg here, maybe even here where the machine, where the turret is. And then I place the turret there. I think that's an okay spot. I probably can't Molotov out of here, but I should be able to shoot out of here. I guess I can try it real quick to find out. That's no good. I can pick the, the turret up. Let's see. Yeah, I can still shoot. I just can't throw a Molotov out of here. But I can from this way. And then I did upgrade that last piece to concrete, so. Now it's like a little maze. We will have to build a few more hatches just to stop them. I think it's coming together pretty nicely. They've got three ways up. They've got at least two straight paths to me. One that's prone for them falling. The other one is, is more solid. Just in case uh, this one fails or they break this out. And then if, if it comes to it where they're just, they broke all three sections out, then we're going to be just running back and forth trying to kill them before they s demolish the corners, or at least the supports. And then I still have to fill all of this in with my spikes. I guess I could do it in waves like this. Kind of create a maze, see if they wander. I don't think they will, but they may. Because they're wood, they're going to get, they're going to get demolished. Do have enough iron? We're probably taking to iron. All right, we're running out of daylight. Let's head back to the scout. We're going to drop off our building materials. And then we're going to run some quests to get uh, acclimated to the demons. Right, so I grabbed my magnum. A little desert vulture action. I'll mod it out. And then I do have my coal shotgun just in case. But unfortunately, I don't have any of the ammo with me. I thought I grabbed it, but I guess I didn't. How may I serve you? So... Starving tourists, they're for sure going to be demons. Can you help me? Let's try that one. Uh, let's see which way we got to go that way. So we'll... Yeah, we'll stop at base. We'll get the coil rounds because I forgot them and then head over. Get the shoddy ready just in case. I've got a few mods on it, but I don't have anything like these. Uh, can you go away? Oh, 
Holy crap. Wait for it. I guess her scream didn't work. Okay. Head back to the scout. Yeah, as long as we get headshots with this thing, I will be okay with the demons. Body shots just not gonna cut it. Hi, lady. Great job. No, the better compound crossbow, huh? Of course, we can make mods. Odd that ours is better than this one. So we're going schematics. So we can make some mods for tomorrow. Uh, specifically the blessed metal mod. This one. I gotta make a lot of this one. Double damage to demons. Alright, one more. More practice, please. Uh, spiders, dogs, uh, dishonorable discharge. Let's do tourists. Let's head that way. Sun's getting low in the sky. We better hurry up. Alright, so I know I can defeat the tourists with this shotgun. Explode. Got him. Alright, let's upgrade. Circle around. There's one. Too shabby. Yeah, with the, uh... Oh, hi, lady. With the demons, it's almost a requirement to do coil. I reckon we can save all the magnum and stuff for, uh, Blood Moon. Okay, let's head back. Uh, I don't know exactly what time it is. We can ask her. All right, lady. Great job. What a Winchester rifle, huh? What's this about? Greater stopping power than a standard rifle with a larger magazine uses the 44. I do need something to use a lot more of the 44s. Yeah, it's 1900 hours. We don't got enough time to run. Ah, we could probably one more. One more. Spiders. Soldiers. Can you help me? Oh, inspect that way towards base. Good. Yeah, so this will definitely be the last one. We just won't have time to do anything else. And then tonight we're going to have to make uh, some of the blessed metal mods. I need to install those on some of my weapons for Blood Moon because I'm expecting demons this time. Uh, not super excited about that considering the explosions they do. And then I will start making tons of forged steel because I suspect we're going to have to upgrade to forged steel here soon for the base. All right, so this is soldiers, so I don't know what to expect. Okay, that's bad. They're demonic. We're gonna have to go with the normal, uh, the coil gun. Oh, they won't spit though, will they? Uh, actually, let's see. It still takes a lot of wax, but they don't spit. That's a good thing. Right back to the scout. Or time runs out in the day. Great job. All right, another coil carbine. Right, let's do the coil rounds. Yeah, because we're going to need those. We'll put those in the pistol. Okay, sun's beginning to set. Got a lot of mod making to do tonight. Tomorrow is Blood Moon. We got to prep the electricity. Got to get the electric fences installed and ready to go. The generator. Fill up the SMG turret. Get the switches installed and the lights. Tomorrow should be an exciting day. Get ready for tomorrow. Hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please leave a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And if you have, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. On the next video, Blood Moon. Until then, laters.
Here we go. I was hoping this wouldn't happen. Looks like they're at least going around. But they go around. We can at least pop a few on the way through. I was kind of expecting this. They have been showing up in the middle of the night. Because this is how dark it really is. They come. Because I like turning the corner and around that way. It's kind of weird. Let's sneak up to the roof and see what we can do. A little bonus footage for you. Yeah, we really don't need to get spotted here. My door alone, punk. I haven't seen any of the night stalkers yet. I don't know if they don't know what to do or what. Yeah, we were just downstairs making mods when they popped in. Did it? Need more spawning in. Let's check over here, make sure nobody ran around the building and just hanging out. Hmm? No, don't run away. I need your XP. 